Hi guys, welcome back. So the last couple of weeks it's been way too cold for me to shoot down here, but I have managed to whip up this nice little new pellet catcher. It's lead lined, which is gonna be important going forward when we're doing a lot more shooting with the lead free pellets. They are very prone to ricocheting. So these lead lined pellet traps are an awful lot safer get far less ricochets from these and they're also quite a lot quieter when the pellets impact these than traditional steel plate pellet holders. Now this one takes an A4 card which I seem to be shooting a lot more of now on film. I'll take the card out there and you can see here now the backing of this is actually a cheapy baking tray quite a stout one. I've got about 10 pounds in weight of melted down fishing weights in there very simple, super stout and an awful lot safer and going forward I think it's just going to look a bit cleaner on film as well. I can use it like this in landscape with the two targets side by side and if we're running it out to longer range we can just simply turn it on its side if we need more elevation on our target. So I think in time I'm probably going to end up building a few more of these in different sizes, maybe some smaller square ones to take some of the smaller target cards as well. But I've got a little time lapse that I'll put up of the build. It was super fun to melt all the lead down. Of course, you do need to be really careful with decent ventilation, your safety squints and all of that. But it was good fun, nice and easy to make, basically cost next to nothing, especially if you're using recycled materials. And the best thing about using this lead backstop is it's almost infinitely recyclable. By the time this fills up with a load of pellets and things, we can just hit it with a blowtorch to flat it off or we can remove some lead and I can basically turn them back into fishing weights again. So nice little project, definitely worth considering, especially if you're shooting in your back garden. It will be an awful lot safer and a lot, lot quieter. So I'll stick up the time lapse now and I'll catch up with you at the end.
hopefully in the next couple of days the weather will perk up a little bit it's been so cold but as soon as it warms up a little bit i want to get out and then we'll get some pellets shot into the lead lined trap i think you'll be quite surprised at how much more efficient this is at collecting the pellets going forward and also the next couple of videos we've got some more anschutz content coming up I'm going to be doing a few substantial modifications to this. I've got a new chassis for it, well, a new old one I built a long time ago is coming back to me. So we're probably going to end up building some fresh grips and bits and pieces for that. So hopefully I can get a bit of time off over Christmas, get a bit more woodwork done, get a few of these little projects done while it's so cold. So hopefully it'll go to plan and I'll catch you in the next one, guys.